In this lesson, we will use a GeoGebra animation to better understand how to plot a point using cylindrical coordinates. And the URL for the animation is shown here. An ordered triple in cylindrical coordinates is r, theta, z, where r, theta is the polar representation of a point in the xy plane, which means r is the directed distance from the origin in the xy plane. So if we take a look at the graph on the right, for point P, R is this red distance here. Theta is the angle counterclockwise from the pole or positive x-axis in the xy plane. On the right, theta is represented by this blue rotation here from the positive x-axis, and z is the directed distance up or down from R comma theta to the point, which we see here in green on the right. And now let's take a look at the animation. Again, the URL for the animation is shown here in blue. Let's plot the point 3, 2, 4 using cylindrical coordinates. This indicates r equals 3, theta equals 2, and z equals 4. Again, r is the directed distance from the origin in the xy plane. So we'll start at the origin and move out along the positive x-axis, 3 units. r equals 3 also defines this cylinder in which the point will be on. Next, theta equals two, which is the angle counterclockwise from the pole or positive x-axis. So here we see the rotation given by theta. Because theta is two, we know that means two radians. And finally, z equals four, which is the directed distance up or down from this red point here in the xy plane. Because it's positive four, we now go up four units. This is the location of the point 3, 2, 4 using cylindrical coordinates. Again, r is the directed distance from the origin, so if we change r, we can see how it affects the point. Notice how it changes the cylinder. If we change theta, it changes the angle of rotation from the positive x-axis. If we change z, we change the distance up or down from the point r comma theta in the xy plane. I hope you found this helpful.